Oh hey, welcome to Burns TV. On today's episode, we're going to be talking about the dark art of tuning with the magical warlock of the East, Michael. Enjoy. Hi, my name's Mike from Burns Drums and Percussion. I'm going to show you how to tune your drum kit. Um, and this is a tom we've got here, a Yamaha tom. And basically, to start off with, what you should do is make all of the uh, from loose, you want to make them all uh, finger tight. So you go around and you make them all finger tight like this. So they all start off at the same tension. And now you have a drum key, and what you do is, what I do anyway, is you do a half a turn on each one on opposites. So half a turn, half a turn, half a turn, half a turn, half a turn. And then you give it a tap. So it still sounds pretty rubbish. So what you need to do is you need to keep going. So do half a turn. And follow this again and again. Remembering where you started. And then what you now need to do is just kind of stretch the head out a little bit. And now what you do is you need to go around and see which ones need kind of either going up or down. So, so to me these two seem a little bit lower. So just give them a little bit of a catch up. repeat the process on the bottom head. So once again just follow exactly the same as before. Make start off making sure they're all finger tight. So they're at the beginning and then again do half turn with the key on opposites. Exactly repeating what I've already done. A little bit more. And just a bit. But as long as you do them all the same it should stay in tension with itself. in pitch as you seat, there, seat it in. And the purpose of doing this is so that when you play the drums, after you've played it a few times, it won't suddenly drop in pitch because you want it to stay, stay in tune. Common problem for drummers with their toms is that the top head and the bottom head, they, they sound different. Um, and the best way to describe it is that the note bends. For example, this one here. You'll hear that the top head's tight and the bottom head is loose. So what you need to do is you need to tighten up the bottom head to stop the pitch bending. So I'll play it again. So it goes doing. <laughs> Probably the best way to describe it. So what you would do is you would turn it over and tune up the bottom head. Following the process that I've already talk talked about earlier, work on opposites. So we might go up a little bit more. Just a little bit more opposites again. Okay, so now that's the tune itself. So Mike Norris and Burns drums, over and out. And now a forecast, some chance of rain, about a 30% about a, uh, chance of precipitation in the north, being replaced by sunny spells later on this evening and into the night.